cabinet spokesperson, Minister Rajita Sena Ratna, has rejected the resolution passed by the Northern Provincial Council yesterday, which claims that a genocide took place in the north of the country. <laughs> When this resolution was brought forward once before, the Provincial Council rejected it. The current Chief Minister himself removed this word from that resolution. There is no reason to include what was removed then, today. There was no genocide. In the final phase, it was the LTTE that used the people in these areas, the Tamil people, as a human shield. It is because they used people as a human shield that a large number of people were killed. If there was a genocide then, the responsibility lies with the LTTE and not with the government forces. So we reject this talk of genocide. We know that no government will accept this. They will always state their stance. We have no problems with the stance of the government. We have intervened with the hope of securing international intervention. If justice is being served through an internal process, then there is no reason for us to seek international intervention. I believe that the political leaders who represent the Tamil people in the north have been pushed into this position. Tamil people do not only live in the north. There are Tamil people who live in the central hills too. However, since the majority live in the northern province, more attention has been focused there. These people gave the votes that were hoped for to change the government, but now great disappointment has arisen there. I believe that this situation is portrayed through Vigneshwaran's statement or the resolution that has been made. They cannot be blamed for it.